cheesecake. Good to see you again, buddy. Yeah, man, how are you? Not too bad, not too bad. Well, Albert, this is my cow, Dolly. Dolly, this is my cousin, Albert, and his cow, Daisy. It's a pleasure to meet you, Mr. Albert. Nice to meet you, too, uh, Dolly. Nice to meet you, Dolly. It's a pleasure to meet you, Miss Daisy. That's right, you got over there. Well, you know, it's tough for farmers up here to get into our supply managed market. That's the best he can do while making payments on the quota he bought for $33,000 a piece. Well, it got you here. That's all that matters. Man, it's been way too long. I was thinking on you the way- You know what? We'll let two bowls catch up. I desperately need to find the ladies' room. Uh, mind if I join you? I have some methane to leave myself. Of course not. Whoa, where did you find Dolly? Oh man, we met way back when she was a heifer. No, no, no. I mean, where did you find a cow with a bag like that? Oh, that's nothing to bell her about. Out of the 9 million gals we have back home, 30% look like that. It's the injections we give them. Injections? Yeah, recombinant bovine somatotropin. It causes the gals to produce like an extra 10 to 15% of milk on average. I guess that's why they call my dolly Double D's. <laughs> well, where the heck do you get your hoof on something like that anyways? Well, back in Russia in the 1930s, they used to just take it from the anterior pituitary of dead cows. Please tell me they don't still do that. Nah, they developed a way to produce it uh, in genetically altered E. coli. It's almost exactly the same as the hormone that the cows produce naturally. Only a few altered amino acids. Jeez, you sure know a lot. Well, what else is there for a bull to do when uh, no one's in heat? Yeah, what do you and Dolly do when she's not in heat anyways? We like to motorboat. <laughs> Alright, I got a question, and I don't care how rude it sounds. But is that thing actually real? <laughs> you betcha, 100% real udder. Well, the pause like helps a bit. Pause like? Yeah, RBST. Hmm, I've heard of that. It's an injection, right? How does an injection give you an udder like that? Let me tell you something, sweet pea. What it does is it reduces the uptake of glucose in my muscles and fat and it increases the glucose production in my liver, allowing for more glucose to go to my mammaries. Hmm, but it's still a needle. I just hate them. How many do you need to get? Well, I got the first one nine weeks after I calfed, and then I get one every 14 days until I go to the dry pan. A little pain for a lot of beauty. I don't know if it's worth it. Um, you're just jealous because Canada banned it in 1999. I am not jealous. I just believe in giving my farmer real wholesome milk. Something you can't do. Alright, let me tell you something. Okay, my milk has been proven by your scientists that there's no consumer risk. Whatever. I'm getting hungry. There must be a trough around here someplace. Let's go find our bulls. Yeah, it's a good milk. It's in again. Yeah. 